No one had ever in five decades accused Johnny Depp of being violent with a woman. What have you lost as a result of Ms. Heard making these allegations against you? Nothing less than everything. The heat of the defamation trial between Johnny Depp and Amber Heard is getting hotter. And while we're thinking Johnny Depp is the only one who caught the flames of abuse from the Aquaman star, we might just be wrong. Research has shown that Amber Heard's relationship has indeed been tumultuous from the very beginning. And as far as we can remember, her ex-girlfriend and several others were certainly not exempted from the turmoil. Could there be a pattern of abuse in the Aquaman star's lifestyle? And aside from Johnny, who have been the victims of this pattern? Let's get right into the video and find out. It's no recent news that Amber Heard is sexually attracted to both the female and male genders. Sadly, she has also been accused of projecting abuse to both genders. Her ex-girlfriend, Taseya Van Rie, became her partner in 2008, and they drew the curtain to their love four years later. However, everyone is eager to know if abuse is embedded in their love story. The internet took us back to 2009 when Heard was arrested for misdemeanor domestic violence in Seattle for allegedly seizing Rhee and struck her arm. Oops, that's no good news if you'd ask me. Shortly after that, Heard was taken into custody and booked for misdemeanor domestic brutality, after which she was allocated to King County District Court in Seattle a day after the incident. A mugshot was taken and her case was assigned a number. While the prosecutor refused to press charges against Heard, Rhee also asserted that the actress had been erroneously accused of the incident. Well, we wouldn't know if love got the best of her or if she was really telling the truth. Either way, Rhee also got served. In court documents obtained by the Daily Mail, the Pirates of the Caribbean star claimed to have had conversations with a number of Heard's former romantic partners about her alleged history of abuse. Several women who have been in a relationship with Ms. Heard have come forward to share their personal experiences of brutal violence and other abuse at the hands of Ms. Heard. Depp reportedly wrote, My advisors have and continue to interview these victims who remain deeply fearful of Ms. Heard and to collect evidence from these victims. However, it appears as though Tasia Van Rie isn't the only one that got served the meal of assault by Heard. Heard's former assistant, Kate James, has also testified to being verbally and emotionally assaulted by the Aquaman star. The former assistant has alleged that Heard spat in her face during the negotiation on a salary raise, and that a handyman who witnessed the incident was left mortified and embarrassed with Heard's actions. She leapt up out of her chair and put her face four inches from my face, spitting in my face, telling me how dare I ask the salary I was asking for. She felt that gave her the right to spit in my face. The employee also recalled that Heard would often scream over the phone and subject her to barrages of abusive text messages day and night. The middle of the night, I think, between 2 and 4 a.m., the barrage would start. All incoherent, not making sense, just someone to lash out at, no apparent reason for it. She further stated that the actress took the Provigil sleeping aid and that the side effects of the medicine sent her into having a manic episode. It was similar to if someone was on some sort of amphetamine drug, moving very fast, hyper-organizing, hyper-tasking, just very, very hyper. James also alleged that Heard had told her that she had taken mushrooms, ecstasy, and cocaine, and said that the Aquaman star became more and more belligerent and abusive when she was intoxicated. With this information, it's rather ironic for her to use Depp's habit of drinking and drug intake against him. However, Kate James didn't end there. She went further to reveal that Heard was also abusive to her sister, Whitney. According to her, the Aquaman star treated her sister like a dog you kick and left her own mother terrified by her behavior. Well, let's analyze the relationship between Whitney and Amber. It's been speculated that the two ladies may not be as loving to each other as the paparazzi pictures show, 
and unseen footage from a reality TV show dating back to 2006 or 2007 has indicated this claim. The video showed that Whitney, whose name is Enriquez on the show, may have been subject to physical abuse from her sister. In the footage, one of Enrique's co-stars quizzes her on bruises that she allegedly got from her sister during an altercation. While inspecting Enrique's and asking her about the alleged fight, Enrique's simply responded by saying, we're not going to talk about that. As an evidence of Amber's act of violence, Depp's team have pointed to this incident that Heard had indeed abused Whitney in the past, but Whitney later refuted against the allegation, saying, we were referring to a verbal argument my sister and I got into, and indicated that there was no physical abuse during the altercation. Yet again, Team Pirates has invaded social media with fierce thoughts about Amber's constant act of violence, and they have concluded that Amber must face the wrath of the law. One fan wrote, Just look at Amber Heard's reaction when she was asked about her abuse to Whitney during her deposition. Yeah, she was busted. So far we know she's abused Tasia Van Rie, Johnny Depp, her sister, and Kate James. Let's move on to her abusive tendencies because she is more than one victim. In 2009, Amber was arrested for abuse after she was caught hitting her then-girlfriend, wife, Tasia Van Rie by a police officer, another commented. One fan went as far as stating that Amber Heard needs to be stripped of her role as an activist. There should be a petition to remove Amber Heard as UN Human Rights Ambassador. Hitting men, women, based on court testimonies and evidences, we know she was mentally and physically abused by Johnny Depp, Tasia Van Rie, Whitney Heard, and Rocky Pennington. Shame on you, United Nations. Well, that might be a lot to handle, but truly, the court's verdict is majorly capable of contributing to numerous decisions made by brands, organizations, and enterprises when the trial is finally over. As expected, Team Amber has expressed nothing but anger towards the allegation that Amber has always been violent. A few fans pointed out that Amber never assaulted Tasia Van Rie. One fan wrote, you clearly have no idea what you're talking about because she never even supposedly hit her. They arrested her because they saw her grab her arm. Another fan added, Tasia said that Amber was never abusive and the officers handling the case were homophobic and only escalated it to assault charges after finding out they were a couple. While supporters of the Aquaman star have concluded that Amber is indeed the victim, one fan wrote, Hello, Johnny is the one who cut himself wrote letters on a mirror with his own blood, used drugs, and acted absurd. Our girl is just so fine. Dr. Curry, aka hired by John, needs to write a report of him first. At Real Amber Heard, it's very hard to prove you are a victim when you don't fit the victim narrative and fight back. I am Team Amber and will remain so. Stay strong, pretty girl. You're not alone, another commented. Amber is right. So unreal how people say she is evil just because she raised her voice over man violence, a fan lamented. Whether or not Amber has ruined many relationships, including her relationship with Depp, the court is yet to decide what the fate of the two stars is. Itchy to know more? Fans have remained glued to the internet, waiting for more details about the ex-couple's relationship and, of course, the final verdict. Do you think the accusation of Amber's pattern violence is valid? Or do you think she is still the victim in all these dramas and emotional games? Let us know what you think in the comment section below. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to this channel. Stay connected as hotter reports are coming your way.